Hi, my name is Jim Decker and I'm the CEO of Backscatter Underwater Video and Photo. This month the Image Plus column for Scuba Diving Magazine is all about how to get the best results from your compact digital camera. Here's some tips and tricks to get the most out of your compact camera. Let's go over camera settings. I like to set the ISO to 100 so it can darken the background. Also, a low ISO will result in lower noise in your image. Next is white balance. If you're shooting still images with a strobe, set the white balance to auto. You'll rarely need to make a color correction, and if you're shooting raw, white balance can be redone in post-processing non-destructively. You can also set a custom white balance. This is good for shooting ambient light video and stills. For now, let's set it back to auto white balance since we'll be shooting stills. Let's move on to RAW. If you can, you want to shoot RAW. It is an uncompressed file format and result in the best image quality and result in better detail and smoother blue water backgrounds. If you can only shoot JPEG, shoot the largest size and the highest quality. The highest quality is usually called fine or super fine. If you're interested in shooting HD movies, shoot the highest resolution you can. On this camera we can shoot full HD at 1920 by 1080. You're going to want to turn off the AF assist beam. It will only light up the inside of your housing and won't shine light on your subject. If you need a focus light, it's better to use an external dedicated underwater focusing light. Let's take a look at LCD brightness. Since camera screens are made to be used in bright sunny conditions, by turning the LCD brightness down one or two clicks, it helps you better see your exposure underwater in a darker environment. Let's take a look at how you can control your exposure. Don't use the green auto mode. It will lock you out of almost all control of the camera. Instead, use P mode or program auto. This will allow you to control settings such as ISO, exposure compensation, and flash. This will allow you to take control of your exposure and expose for your background and your foreground separately. Use exposure compensation to adjust your background exposure. This is the plus minus button that is on your camera. You can then dial up or down your exposure. Always use macro mode. This will allow you to use the full focusing range of the camera. This is especially important when using external wide angle lenses as they make objects appear closer than they really are. Lastly, I want to encourage you to shoot some underwater video. Most compact cameras are now shooting 720 or 1080 HD video. If you have an HD TV at home, you owe it to yourself to shoot some video. Here's some video I shot with a compact camera. It is shot with a wide angle lens and a custom white balance and ambient light only. Hope you enjoy.